Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Elmaz and today I will show you how I get my white towels white and bright and fluffy again. I even wipe my makeup sometimes with my white towels and I still get to get those makeup off my white towels and make them look brand new. So if you're still interested, please keep on watching. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing. Let's take a look. When you are doing laundry, first you want to make sure you remove the stain. Um, this is my famous stain remover. I've been doing this for a couple years and I swear by this DIY stain remover. Uh, you need some uh, hydrogen peroxide and some Dawn. Uh, when you're working with hydrogen peroxide, you need to make sure that you use it right away because air or light can react to peroxide and it's not gonna have the same effect. And that's why I'm using a dark bottle, keeping it and storing it in my uh, cabinet inside the dark um, area, basically. And you need two parts of 3% hydrogen peroxide and one part Dawn dish soap. So I'm using one cup of peroxide and half a cup of Dawn. So the ratio is one to two. You can double that. You can half that based on uh, the amount that you need. One cup of hydrogen peroxide. Perfect. And I'm doing a half a cup of Dawn dish soap. and then shake it really well. Here we go. Look at all the stain here. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray directly on top. And then what I like to do, I like to go ahead with the old toothbrush, just kind of, you know, scrub that in just like this. Do you see it's kind of already disappearing? I'm telling you, this is the best stain remover ever. Makeup, tanning lotion, food, blood, you name it. This will take care of it. So I'm going to the next towel. Any stain that I have, again, this is just a small stain right here. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this go with my brush. I'm sure you see a little red spot here. Again, we're doing the same thing. It's almost actually gone. Just that easy. If the stain is really tough to remove, just let it sit for 20 minutes before throwing it in the machine. Also, if your towels do not have any stain and you don't need to use that stain remover on top of your towels, what you wanna do, you wanna drop one teaspoon of Dawn dish soap on one of the white towels, fold it, and throw it with the rest of your white towels. Just like this. Then our next step is to take about half a cup of baking soda and pour it anywhere in your machine. Next is borax. I love to use this stuff even in a household cleaner because they get rid of mold and mildew. Also, they are booster for detergent as it said it on here and it really helps to remove stain and neutralize odor and make your whites whiter. The next step is adding half a cup of borax to your load. And this is great, especially because we are not using a bleach. Borax is a good alternative to make those white towels whiter. And again, I'm just going to go ahead and throw it right here. If you have the powder detergent, that's fine. But I like to use the liquid detergent and just do a cap full of liquid detergent or cap full of your powder detergent. Mm -hmm. 
the last and most important thing is to not use the fabric softener. Instead, this is vinegar. Use vinegar. You can use, again, half a cup of vinegar instead of using a fabric softener. A lot of people ask me, oh, your clothes gonna smell like vinegar. I promise you it won't smell at all like vinegar. And I, again, swear by this. Um, I've been doing this for years. I love it. I never use and spend money for fabric softener. And the reason why you want to put your white vinegar in this fabric softener dispenser is because this way it slowly dispenses the vinegar throughout the final wash cycle. And then the next step is you want to make sure to wash your towels in a hot water. After the wash, before you throwing them in the dryer, make sure you shake each individual towel. This will fluff them out and making them more absorbent and soft. Do not ever use a dryer sheet. Instead, use a dryer ball or tennis ball and this will puff up the towels and make them really absorbent. Now that the towels are all dry, let's take a look. Oh my God, do you guys see these white, bright towels in there? I mean, even feels so soft and fluffy. Um, it's honestly amazing and you don't even have to just use it on towels. I use it on my white t-shirt and I had a stain on this t-shirt. It take the stain away. Also, it just makes it super bright and white. And But the towels, I mean, look at it. I know you guys see a little bit of a dark shadow there, but I promise you it's just a shadow. It's really bright and white and it's really soft by touch. I really hope you guys uh, use this technique at home and let me know in the comment what you think. And if you enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.